Welcome back everybody, it is time to lock down some MTGO. We are going to be playing some popper slivers today. Uh, I figure we'll close out the week with some popper. Uh, this hand is keepable, so we will keep it. So we're jumping right into it, I don't know what we're up against. Uh, we're going up against some Boros, we'll see what happens here. through this turn there we go all right uh, I guess we will uh, go ahead and get this out of the way now pass it back to them turn down this music a little bit maybe there we go I'll actually do that there we go uh, yep yield through this turn just playing out our lands passing it back to me no big deal hmm all right, so I think we're just gonna go ahead and start with Sidewinder here. Keep up vines, just in case I just try to go for the instant burn spell on it, possibly. All right, gonna cycle. See what they're playing. All right, faithless looting, huh? We'll say okay to that. Gonna have to keep an eye on their graveyard. It seems like potentially. All right, what do we got here? We got a pilgrim. Or a card, is this? Hmm, okay. Still have no clue what we're up against. <laughs> I hate that I have like no clue what any of these uh, things are. All right, yep. I just wanna make sure they're not going for anything. Okay, there we go. So we have a little bit of time here. Let's go, our, go ahead and start playing our slivers out. Start attacking. All right. Let's see what they do this turn. Just Ash Barons, Pilgrim. All right, six cards in hand for them. Feels so awkward going in, going in blind against all these popper decks, but hey. All right, can sacrifice, give them a mana. No big deal. Uh, when it dies, create a token. Echo. What does Echo do? I'm assuming it like can bring him back, maybe. Oh, I thought it said when it dies. Oh, when it enters or dies. All right, so it gets a couple tokens. Not a big deal. Uh, we've got a lot of different options here. Let's go ahead and play out our hand. Oh, we accidentally missed that. Uh, oopsies. That's a bummer. There we go. Misclick already. He'll get another goblin from that. Yep, flanking. Mm-hmm. All right, so. Since I missed doing this, All right, feel free. We're at their mercy for one turn. I think we'll be okay. We got a hefty board right now. All right, make it a bunch of mana. Don't know what they're setting up for. Probably a way to get rid of my board, maybe. Are they just comboing off like crazy right now? 
we'll see. I have no clue what they're doing. Enchanted creature gets still end of turn. Is he just... I can't even tell, like, what's taking place here. Yeah, we're just gonna sit and wait, I guess. It's got a storm count going. Okay, storm count's gonna do something to us. This is how we learn Popper, because uh, I have no clue what we're up against here. We are under tournament practice, so the decks are going to get a little bit more gnarly. He's playing relatively fast, so we just got to wait it out. Let's just see what card he's going to get. Mog, huh? How do I look at Mog? One damage to any target. So, what does he do? He just, uh... Sacrifices him a ton and slowly whittles down my team, is what I'm assuming. Or any target. He can just do it to my face, I suppose. be a complete waste of my time just show me how you're gonna kill me your storm counts up to 17 this is insane well we're gonna have them play their deck out here I you know I want to I'm curious I want to see how it resolves and I'm sure they don't get to do this that often, so. Yeah. You're at 22 storm count right now, so. Where are we going with this? This is so pointless. Just finish me off. Do what you need to do. What does it take for you to finish the game? I'm just waiting for them to have enough to where they can just give everything haste or something and attack in or Because their storm counts at 30, but I don't even think that matters right now at this point Maybe it does but again, it's like It is what it is They're down to 15 minutes Curious to see how long it's actually gonna take them to finish the game because we could try to win on time but they are moving relatively fast so we'll see all right he's starting to deal damage yeah okay now he's starting to deal damage was he already i wasn't paying attention Was I right? He just keeps doing Mog Fantic and just slowly whittled me down one at a time. Yeah. It sure takes him a long time. Alright, I'll yield through this, uh, this turn again. Because we're going to let him do it. I mean, if it takes him 10 minutes to finish out the game right now on this, I mean, that's a long time. We can win just on time here. This seems so, like, unbeneficial just for the mere fact that I'm at, I'm at 16, they're at 11 minutes, and they still have to keep doing this every single time we will literally just win on time oh we got hit we got hit for one again guys it only took him three minutes to hit me for one
So is this how you beat this deck? You let them just run out of time? This is ridiculous. This is just how you beat the deck. You just let them whittle their own time down because they can't play fast enough. I mean, they're playing fast, too. Like, they are clicking through this really well. But they gotta do, like, what, like five different things just to deal one damage to me? I guess they're just banking on someone conceding? I guess that's what's happening here? Oi. It's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that's hilarious. They knew it too. They just disconnected the match. Wow. Okay, well, I guess that's how they win, huh? They just, uh, they either won. No, that's all that, that's the only reason how they win. They, they can't move fast enough for, for their combo to work efficiently unless they're not doing it right which maybe they're not doing the combo right i don't know but if this is how fast they can move in mtgo they the only way they bank on winning is if you the opponent concedes the game and just says oh they got their combo i guess i lost oh well i'll concede no thanks sorry <laughs> i'm not i'm not doing that that's crazy Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. That was a silly game. I don't even know if I'm going to post this because that was kind of ridiculous. But uh, if you guys did enjoy it and want to keep seeing me play some popper slivers, leave a like. Let me know in the comments. And we will see you guys in the next video.